The U.S. is applying a methodology to warfare called Effects-Based Operations, or EBO, to help meet the critical challenges posed by the dangerous new strategic environment. EBO requires a shift in our thinking, leveraging modern technology and better integrating all elements of national power to incorporate multiple options, kinetic and non-kinetic, lethal and non-lethal. The methodology that both the U US military and its close partners are seeking to develop here is a deeper understanding of the intervening effects that come between the tactical actions conducted out in the battle space and the achievement finally of those uh, political end states that are uh, desired. Uh, whereas in the past many of these causal linkages would just have been assumed as being intuitive, um, now it's getting into an analysis of these where we can hopefully, um, before setting out on an operation, be assured that the actions we are planning to conduct will indeed uh, deliver the effects uh, that we're looking for. Operation Iraqi Freedom, or OIF, provides us with an excellent example of the application of EBO methodology. Thanks to EBO, we were able to achieve, with few losses, the rapid collapse of Iraqi organized resistance while using a smaller number of forces than would have been necessary with a tactical force-on-force -force methodology.